Let's get started in some soft body. First up, I'm just gonna move this cube up to the top and double tap rotate, just give it a bit of an obscure angle. Shift A, add in a plane, scale that up. Now let's come over into the physics tab. I'm gonna set the plane to have a collision for our soft body to hit. Let's select our cube and jump over into soft body. Now, if we press play, it kind of just hangs there. Now that's the fault of the goal. So the goal wants it to stay in that position. So if we go back to the start and press play, it'll fold into a flat plane. Now to quickly resolve that, we can go into edges and enable stiffness. Press play. Jelly. And if we just want that cube to be looking like that, that's fine. However, if you want to give it a little bit more oomph, I can go tab into edit mode, right click subdivide, subdivide. Back into object mode, let's press play. And it crumples down again. This is where we can now increase our bending. So if I go probably about two, let's press play. And you can see it does crumple a little bit, but it keeps its shape. Now with that, you can kind of see how it bounces around, but it still keeps its shape. What we can do is come over into plasticity. And if I bump that to a hundred, and let's give it another subdivide, why not? If I press play, we can see that it kind of almost turns up into Play-Doh. So that def deformation will stay there. Sick. So that's all how you want to do it. So I'm going to maybe just give it a little bit of dense. So if we come back to play, we should see a little bit of collapsing here, but predominantly it comes back into shape. Let's jump into cache. Once we've saved the file, we can set our start and end time of the simulation. And then we can go bake all dynamics. And then we go, now we've baked that soft body. Let's now do a little bit of extra. And bop, 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 bop. Oh, the idiot that I am, I forgot to give each of the objects a collision. And if we press play again, sick. Now this is different to rigid body animation, purely based off the fact that there would be no flexing of the object. Um, but once again, play with the settings. This is an introduction to doing this jazz.